Hi guys, welcome to our channel 3 Minutes Master, where you can learn any concept in 3 minutes. In this video, I want to give you an idea towards the basic structure of a C program. Here we go. Just like a tree having a structure like a, a roots, branches, leaves, fruits, a C program do have a particular structure. Now, I'll be saying them. It first consists of a section called documentation section. In this section, we write certain comment lines. Here comment lines start with slash asterisk and we'll be typing some sample text and then end with asterisk slash. It contains uh, the basic details regarding uh, the program. And the next part is related to link section. See, C has rich set of built-in functions. So in order to uh, use them, we make use of this particular section called link section. For example, I have declared two header files here, hash include stdavo.h, hash include conivo.h. They come under link section. And the part is definition section. Here we can define some user defined functions or else so called constant values. In this example, I have defined void fun. Next one is related to global declaration function. If a variable is used in more than one function, it is better to declare them in a global declaration section so that that particular variable can be seen in all the functions. And the next part is the main function. Every C program have one main function which indicates the basic starting of the program. This part do consist of two steps declaration part and executable part in declaration part in this example i have given int b is equal to 20 it comes under declaration part and next uh, every c program must contain a valid c statement that belongs to executable part in this program i have given printf statement to print the values of a and b and the last section is sub program section here you'll be writing all those uh, user defined functions uh, so there can be end user defined functions. This section contains one or more functions defined by the user. For example, here I have declared a user defined function and then I have printed the value of uh, a. That's it. Thanks for watching.